Auction Flex video tutorials. Many of the features located within Auction Flex can be easily overlooked as they're not used on a day-to-day -day basis. For instance, the customer import feature. We're able to take an Excel spreadsheet and import it directly into an auction using bid card numbers or rather into the customer center in general. Let's get right into the customer import by clicking on check in customers and from here the advanced button at the bottom left. Now there's quite a few features here on the advanced page. We're going to be using import customers for this particular video and the goal is to take an Excel spreadsheet with our rows of customers as well as labeled columns across the top by name, address, city, state, etc. Make sure to make a note of the order of these columns as AuctionFlex will ask us for them later. Click on Import Customers and select the spreadsheet. In our case, the customer import file on the desktop and hit next step. On the field mapping screen, we're going to take our available fields and double click them in the order they appeared on the spreadsheet. First, last, address, city, state, zip, phone number, and email address are all included. We also have an ability to enter the bid card number, which will import these customers directly into the auction. Without the bid card, they're imported into the customer center. But let's go ahead and use the bid card for this test. The next step will allow us to review the field mappings to verify everything is correct. It all looks good and we need to skip the first row as our first row explains our columns. The duplicate checker We'll also check for duplicate records upon import. Using the duplicate checker will allow you to merge those records together. As we import our customers, as you can see, five new customers entered. And as we verify it with check-in, they're all there, as well as all in the customer center. That wraps up another quick Auction Flex tutorial. Importing customers is an absolutely wonderful feature, and should you need any more help, please contact our support staff. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.